Yabe mo obi biya kwa ba diaba smart gun update so. Wei, eh hey, news update fufu kwa ne de ba besomo. Abusiya, insembi koswa enye Kennedy Japan de kwa inti. Wama ne officers for no adrafte nyama bi edia kwa koma MPP for MPP for no. Nini na ejina chema wuntu mi. Eni MPP for bi tise. Ona bo na na e yu free ye mo. Ah tise. Omo chema. Omo fre fre. Chema mfobi se chinchina chin. Omo enya shua se ombe tuwa ba ama Dr. Mahama Dubaumia. Enti, se niye beye omo ibenye jidiye se ombe tuwa ma Dr. Mahama Dubaumia no. Enye, omo mfo omo votu no, emo obi fufro kra. A ah, ye friend proxy voting. Na ekamia kamia kwe se, enyo omo ankasa ene babi jina honom dide ni se ombe tuwa ba no. Ne omo mse anko fo na, omo do omo right anasa omo votu. Amo omo se, omo me tuwa ba no ma omo no nebe ba. Anu, ena kenende ye japon fo, omo te ino omo se, enya de se omo beda. Inti omo se des ripe, aki kanyo omo abo Information ni nina a ah, chese. Omagada edi akwa koma party presidential and election committee ni se. Omu yujem e san se. E nyomu bi se yi ne koso. A ah, chese. Omu di evidence isa kan hon se. Omu ohon ma. E ya diya se chema mfu yi. E fre omu. E kachira omu se. Se yi. E na e koso. A ah, chese. Chema un timi e fa funa. Numa fre omu a kachira o se. Omu nye shio. Se se ni e kono be tuwa ba. E di ama. Dr. Mahama Duba Umiya. Anase vice president. E ti. Se ni e be ya omu be ya shio. Se o be tuwa ba. Ama no no. Anase wa ye wa jin se o du vote be man no. Enye, yifa se ubi, haa, ono di omu jini di se, obe rabe tuwa bano. Na edru honu maa, omu nkanchire, empenifoni se, edipa wei, wentimi ama, esa nse, oyari inti, anase ibi ya watu kwa inti. Enti, sese edi omu se omu do omu nse mini nina kwa komu omu. Ne omu, eko ba se, ensemi omu di kwe, party, presidential, and election committee no, omu anfo omu se mino anye hedi haa, they will be compelled to do justice to all the other nine candidates. I ensure se omu subenya sanctity and free and fair elections. Ebusu ya, min pese meka se pi, me pese ya beko, ni akwa kwa ti omu. Eni press release omu de bae, a chese omu meki. Various allegations, a omu pese omu chese, a yadea se e koso, a chese omu bubo bubo, e diya ke siya ke siya uum, ti se chema wun tumi. Eni e fi jase ya sokore constituency. Anamu nana e yu e free e mwenye na, so omu si shim, no omu yesa anyo mano, no omu de evidence, enzo suwa kahun. Ye ba, ye betu wa super pepe, se nye nse mini nina, e si tiye. That, the last of MPs, and the original chairman of MPP, in fact, the name is, uh, let me, let me be specific. Smart Gannon uh, Chairman Wun Tumi, who is calling chairman and the other people who are also going to vote Smart in this Gannon special update. voting, that they should give their right to vote to other people because they do not trust such people that they will vote for the candidate as they make it known to the public. And so that is their fear. Their fear is that some of the people who are going to vote in the special electoral college are not going to vote for their candidates. And for that matter, in order to be sure that their vote is dead or is going, is going for them, those people should relinquish their right to vote and that someone will vote on their behalf. This, we think, is very unfair. This, we think, runs contrary to the dictates Smart of update. the community that was issued by the party's presidential and elections committee. And that is what we want to bring the attention Smart of the party update. or the presidential elections committee to. Is this a development just in Ashanti region or Hello? is widespread? Hello? Yes, Ian, I just wanted to know, is there a development just in Ashanti region or is widespread? Is this, Hello? Is this situation of vote buying, as you say, is it just within Ashanti region or is widespread? It is, it, is, it is widespread. It is all over Ghana. That is what they have been doing. You see, we had this intel some time ago, but then we were waiting, waiting for them to step up the again. We we're waiting for them to walk their talk. And indeed, some people have called us to tell us that they are forcing them or trying to, I mean, buy their votes. And that is why we are out talking to the media. And that is why we are out extending our concern to the Presidential Elections Committee that what they wrote that uh, this election, or, the, or, or if I say, if I may say, that Smart gun update. will not be permitted in this election. It's going on in this election. It's going on at the blind side of the Presidential Elections Committee. Smart if, if, if you say you, you have been called, you have been called by who? Because you make specific mention of Chairman Wu to me, the Ashanti Regional Chairman, leading this. And you also tell us that course, some persons have course, called you, telling you that they are, being, they, are being, they are being forced. And Fidelity of Korea MP is also part. Okay. Honorable Nana, you are free. He is also part of those who are buying the votes. 
It's part of those calling the chairman and other uh, pa pa participants. It's part of those okay, so I want to know which particular chairman or which particular who are those chairmen that have obviously, communicated to your camp. You don't expect me. You don't expect me to come to public. And well, but he, but you have mentioned Chairman Wong to me his name, so it is appropriate and fair that as you've mentioned, I just, I just, Chairman Wong to me his name. I just want you to know. I just want you to know, and Smoke I want them to update. know that we know that this is what they are doing. But you see, for me to mention the names of those people who have informed us, I think that is something that we should know. Right. What What are, are you afraid of? Elections committee. Uh, Ian, I'm not I, afraid of anything. But you see, you don't expect me to put all my arsenals outside. How okay. did I even get information from them? So what I'm saying is that we have it, and I'm sure that as a media team, you also, you must have heard it before we even release this press. In this particular statement, if I read portions of it, it talks about as much as 50,000 Ghana cities per chairman to accomplish that diabolic agenda. 50,000 for all the 275 regional it chairman is, it is it's not free for the chairman even other, that's why i said other participants those okay. who are going to vote in the special electoral college it's not only for the chairman it is not only for the chairman and god being so good they have rejected them but and, 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 and in, ter in terms of the numbers ian and help me understand in terms of uh, the, the numbers for this particular special election how many people are voting again? An update. I do not readily have them, but overall, there should be somewhere around 981. And if each person is going to be bribed 50,000 Ghana cities, is this realistic? Obviously, not all of them are, are not going to vote for them. Some are going to vote for them. So, But they have people that they don't think will vote for them. They don't okay. trust them. That is their way. I'm being specific. They said they are people they do not trust to vote for their candidates. And that if those people really think they will vote for their candidate, they should relinquish their right to vote so that someone votes on their behalf. And that is why they are calling some specific people. Some specific people, not all of them. Do you understand? Okay. They cannot give all of them 50,000. But you see, we are fighting against an incumbent. And so these things they are possible. What is fifty thousand? I mean, <laughs> it is money to you and I. Smart but for some people, fifty thousand is no money. It's just a pinch of salt. So what I'm saying is that it is not all the eight and nine hundred and eighty one people who are going to vote in this special electoral college. But then it is for some specific people who they think will not vote for their candidate, who they think or who they do not trust, and that is the word they use. Some people they do not trust. And you know there are people who are even come out that they will vote for them. But then according to their intel, those people are not going to vote for them. You understand? In, 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 in all of this, this particular uh, uh, document I'm reading is a press statement. So it's directed at the press. Officially, have you written yes. to the party about these concerns? Yes, we are forwarding everything to them. As you can see, we have been in office since last night, and we are still in the office. I haven't been to the house for some time now. Okay. So you know the kind of work that has gone into what we are doing. Is this I not... Have my team over here. Everybody okay. is in the office. Okay. We are working. We've been working since yesterday. We've been picking information, snipers of them. We've been calling here and there. People are calling in here and there that this is what is happening. And, of course, we have come way too far, and we are not going to stop from here so let me obviously, also obviously obviously this is for the media okay we we just wanted the public or we just wanted the uh, 981 people who are going to vote in this special electoral college to be aware that we are standing behind them and that all those people who have rejected their office should not be afraid of anybody okay that nobody can do anything to them that the honorable Kennedy japan and his team will also be behind those people and that nobody can do anything to them or in their subsequent elections nobody can i mean do whatever they checking against them to them so officially this is to the media but have you officially also come uh, uh, copied the party as well that is why i'm saying we have been in the office since yesterday okay. and we are still here this time and so as to what we are doing or as to what we have sent 
to the presidential elections committee. That is how to us to decide. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. Then I said it is not going to end here. So obviously you should know that the presidential elections committee will also be informed and then they will also take steps to rectify this uh, problem at hand. This particular press statement says, whilst the country is waiting for the most popular and efficient person to be chosen by the delegates to contest the national elections, some executive members of the party, as well as government appointees, are doing everything within their powers to ensure uh, that their favorite candidate wins the election, even though he is not popular with the general public. Who, 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 who is this individual we are talking about? Obviously, you saw the name in it. And if I mention them, I won't mention Nana, you are free. You know the person they are voting for. See, I cannot make somebody popular through this interview. But then, obviously, you know the person we are talking about. And again, he stated his name in it. You understand? Now, what I'm saying is that um, both who you mentioned, that they are appointees, they are party executives and the rest, I can also assure you that not all of them are going to vote for them. Okay. And that is why they are afraid, and that is why they are trying to buy their votes. That is why they are trying to ask them to relinquish the right to vote, and then someone votes on their behalf. So what I'm saying is that not all of them are going to vote for them. But as I said earlier, I cannot tell you all my secrets. <laughs> I mean, it will be like giving you all my ass now. But, but what we know, what we have, uh, the information we have, not all of them, not all appointees, not all party executives, not all regional party executives, not all constituency executives are going to vote for them. And we know those who are going to vote for us and those who are not going to vote. You see, going into an election, any good politician, any good politician should know those who are going to vote for them and those who are not going to vote for them. The anomalies may come and then it should be very scanty. So if you don't know all these things, then it means you are not prepared for the elections we are going into. And that also shows that our people on the other side are also very well prepared because they know people will not vote for them. So their intel is also right. And then our intel is also right that they are trying to buy their votes. They are trying to ask them to relinquish their votes and their right to vote in this special electoral college. And that is what we want to um, avoid and bring the attention of the presidential elections committee too. Okay, so uh, at the tail end of this particular uh, release, it talks about if the party fails or refuses to act in accordance with its own guidelines, we will be compelled to ensure that justice is done to all manner of people, candidates in this uh, contest. What, what does that mean? It means that in every election, the sanctity of that election should be protected. Wherever anybody wants to vote, the person has the right to vote to that direction, without fear or favor, without intimidation, without vote buying. That is why we are saying that anybody who decides to vote for the Honorable Kennedy or any other candidate is free to vote for that candidate. And that's those who rejected the money and have been threatened that they will do this to them, they will do that to them. We are also telling them that we are very much aware of what is happening. And we are also backing them. We are also going to support them in their subsequent elections. And that nobody, and I repeat, nobody can threaten them that they will lose their seats in their subsequent elections. We are also behind them. We are also going to make sure that the sanctity of this election prevails. We are going to make sure that the goodwill of the people prevails. And Ian, we have just got some few days to that particular election. And all of this machinations let me put it that way it, it, it's happening are, are, are you that worried are you that concerned why shouldn't you be concerned you I mean everybody is wasting money in this election and so we should be concerned as stakeholders we should be concerned about the going sons in the party we should be concerned and that is why we are in the media that is why we release this press you understand okay so what i am saying is that um um we are on top of our game we are not afraid of anything but then those things that we think do not protect the sanctity of election, whatever we think that will jeopardize this election, we believe we should let the public know. We should also let the party executives, the special electoral college, the participants, we should also let them know that yeah, in this 
we should let them know that as long as they have decided to vote for the Honorable Canada, but we are also behind them, we are solidly behind them, and we are going to back them, and no intimidation, no intimidation will be allowed to fester. 